Ten years ago, this was my favourite game. Things change. <laughs> and another ten years, it'll come back round again. <laughs> You'll be like, I love Fable 3, 2, 1. I don't think I'll ever say I love Fable 3. Let's not get silly. <laughs> Fable 2 is the best of the series. Maybe Fable 4 will happen. Exactly. Here we go. This is going to be diabolical. Arsenal, Arsenal, Arsenal. What? Oh god. <laughs> so many Arsenal fans, they didn't even know. Well, Arsenal is a very so popular team. The entire tube yesterday was echoing with people shouting Arsenal shit. Yeah, no, it was insane. On the plus side, that was very, very funny to see Dave's grumpy, annoyed face. Because he wasn't, he didn't like it. He was getting pissed off about it. This way, please. It would have been like a bit of a well. I was going to say, I think they were, they were playing against Hull, so I, maybe there would have been lots of Hull fans shouting. Yeah, because they're such a famous team. It could well Everyone be. Everyone loves Hull. Welcome to the Hall of. I'm going to get Hull hate. If you follow me, I'll take you to the arena preparation area. Preparation eight. The history of this oh. place is wasted on the public. The arena's first heroes, our land's heritage. But do people care? Nah. People don't want history. They want the heroes of today. Still, tomorrow. The arena needs its own heroes. Hmm, quite profound, that. You can quote me if you like. No. No. <laughs> what was the fucking point of that? Why couldn't you just had... Because surely you, could, you didn't need to make it a cutscene. You could have just walked with that guy while he said that. It's an old game. Just this got new skin, this isn't where we're going to redo it. A couple of basic points first. I can barely act. I, I do not know why I have got this job. Anyone caught trying to we were going to bone right and then she said no. So we did Most of bone. the voices were done by people around the Lion's Head office. Oh yeah. yeah. It was before they started getting big actors and games and stuff, wasn't it? Even just voice actors. Alright, you chameleon. You've heard all this before. Go on. Although well, Legacy of Kane got real actors and that was before no, Fable. Hit him on you didn't want real actors. When it's your turn, I'll call your name and you will enter the arena through the door our friend Chameleon just used. Just like this Once episode of arena, One Piece you watched today. Foes from all over Albion. Every group of creatures you defeat wins your prize money. Yeah, I'll get it. Whatever. Kill the shit, get the money. Let's buy some gear. Yes. Let's have a look, see what the best gear I've got is, because I doubt it's this wizard shit, I'm pretty wearing it because it's cool. Yeah, well you picked up bits and bobs as well. Bits and bobs, bobs and bits, put them all together and what have you got? Tits. No, stop with your crazy Frankenstein tit experiments. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I hate this menu! I hate this menu! <laughs> it loves you. So, right, put the chainmail hat on. Fucking hell. Okay. Yeah, that's the best. Chainmail gauntlets will be the best. Yeah, already got them on. Um. Chainmail. Chainmail. I thought the bandit was higher. No, the chainmail is 333. I don't think you have chainmail trousers. Nope, you do. There we go. That's all of it. Because you're wearing the chainmail boots already. Oh, the, is the dark plate better? It is. There we go. 
<laughs> Are you encumbered? Can you roll? Never mind. <laughs> there is no roll. Yeah, I think you can buy stuff though. Because there's a shop in the middle. Sorry about the lack of introduction. We have a no, you're giving us plenty, mate. If you need any advice about you, sir, are our leader. Is it that big? I don't understand. You just pick that stuff up. You incredible no, that is stealing. I know it's stealing. No, can't do it. So who do you buy them off? <coughs> we have to complete a match first. Well, before you get a buyer. Yeah. I can't let you in. Chameleon is still getting butchered. I hope you're going to put up a better fight. Uh, okay, I can't go in yet. Is there somebody you can talk to? Oh, there you go. You just had to just a time limit. Uh, Ross, bad news. I think Chameleon's, uh, you know, dead. We can't tell because he's chameleoned into the back of the wall. Do you know chameleons don't change? Yeah. Oh well, I won't bother finish my fucking sentence then. <laughs> <laughs> Canadians don't change their colour by their environment, they change the colour via their mood. You look ready. In you go. Talk to it's a myth that they blend into the background. It's probably just something that somebody thought of thought the first time they saw them, isn't it? Like the first time somebody discovered a chameleon and then it changed colour, they thought it was probably because it had something to do with the defence mechanism, not, oh, that chameleon's horny, so it's become red. That, that chameleon's grumpy, so it's become black. They always oh, tell just me this one gives them the started listening to music <laughs> and it wants to and it demands that it calls itself coal black. <laughs> I'm coal black, no relation to Coltrane from the famous Gears of War games. Ladies and gentlemen, for your entertainment. This is not how I remember the uh, the arena looking. How did you remember it looking? I thought it was a big underground cave. Maybe that's the second level. Like you fight, you go into an underground one and you fight monsters. That's the third one. Is that the third one? Yeah. I do not remember this you, at all then. You fight your way, it's like a, this big basement under Reaver's mansion, mm -hmm. and you have to fight your way through different rooms. Right. And it's like, every, you spin a dial every room you go into to see which monsters you're fighting. Yeah, yeah, but isn't there one that, I thought there was one that was set in an underground cavern, and you get to the, like, the monsters, and you have to fight cave trolls and stuff. I thought that was this one. Maybe that's the Maybe second, second one. Get away! I just want to get me electricity out. I really don't remember this. Could this possibly? No, it's not new. Nothing's new. Oh yeah, you get more money based on the clappings. Do you want to slip it up a bit? Do a flex. Yeah, but the is at maximum anyway. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be going down. I thought it was going down. You're just that good, I guess. Are you not entertained? Are we going to watch Gladiator after? I'd really rather not. <laughs> I've not watched it in 10 or 15 years. We have 100 gold. Amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get on with it. <coughs> what is it this time? More bugs. Holes. Hold doors. I swear there was a, a dodge button, but I can't remember what it was now. Wasn't there a roll? Oh, uh, no. there it is. It's not a particularly great one, but... <laughs> I've just rolled into the trap. So you go there, because the pattern is going down there. Look at that. Yeah, that's basically the more damage you cause, the higher it is, the more damage you take. Three, two, one, go.
wonder who makes the Hobbs armor. Because if they're kids that get mutated, hmm. then you know, how the fuck do they know how to make armor? I presume that some of them grow old and... I guess it's the idea that the, the older Hobbs somehow... The older Hobbs have always been taught by the previous generation. So at some point, maybe they weren't always children, maybe they were a race that was dying off and the only way they could continue their life was to infuse their dying essence with children. Which I imagine is more fought than people oh, might no, ever go to them. <laughs> or, well, do you think they were, what, the, do you think the race of Hobbs dealt with almost dying out because they were pedos? Yeah. And rather than try and procreate with uh, female hogs that could give them children, actually give them children, they just wanted to farm children. Yeah. I don't think that's why. I don't think that would have gone down well in the writing room of Lion Gate. I think mine would Lion Gate? Lion Head? Whatever. I think my. <laughs> Not whatever. I think my idea If it was Lion's Gate, it would probably go down great because they make sword and shit. Yeah. Why don't you send that idea to them? <laughs> I don't want to write that. It's like it's like Leprechaun meets Gary Glitter's life. <laughs> Gary Corn. <laughs> Gary Corn. <laughs> Glitter Corn. There we go. Glitter Corn. That sounds like a. Does sound like a horror movie? Do you want to be in my gang? Glitter Corn coming to theaters soon. Do you want to build a glitter snowman? <laughs> corn. Oh, it's just like a Tarantino movie. It's just Gary Glitter telling that story of uh, what's his name, how he got the name for Corn, which you told me years ago. Jonathan Davis. Yeah. I don't even remember the story of how he got the name for Corn. So <laughs> he was at work or something, and it was a Christmas party, and everybody was eating food, and then he went into he was in the toilet. I think he was in the cubicle or something. And then two guys came in, and one guy ate the other guy's shit, and it had corn in it. <laughs> okay, I do not remember that story. I, could, I swear that's the story you told me. Well, if someone told you a corn story, it's bound to be me. Yeah. What's with that? It's a rose. I don't know how to pick it. You can pick it up. I don't know how that. That's how good you are. You get roses. I think that's the story that you told me years ago. I remember <laughs> it having something to do with gay guys and corn. It might have just, or it might have been that. Um, Sounds vaguely. Familiar. He got told he had a gay friend, and the friend told him that one time he was eating someone's arse out on it. And it was that or sounds um, like, yeah, like he was ruining a guy, and the guy got too relaxed and shit in his mouth. And it was like the worst part is there was bits of corn in it. Yeah, it's like corn. That's the name for my bean. How much better would it have been if he called it shit corn? <laughs> well, there's probably a, ba uh, a corn cover band called Shit Corn. <laughs> Right, we can skip this. Trying to let her be sorted. No. Yeah. Like, how does Slip not get their name? I don't know, they're in the Boy Scouts. <laughs> <laughs> Someone taught them how to do a Slip. Slip not to them? I don't know, I used to know. I used to know a lot of things about a lot of bands ten years ago. Yeah. So, you know, I used to know, like, the, the name of every member of every band that I liked, where they were from, because where their names come ends. from. Yeah. Then yeah, and then I stopped giving a shit. What was the last album you actually listened to? Of what? Anything? Yeah, of anything. Like a new the band last, or a. Oh no, I listen to new albums all the time. I just don't care about finding out um, about them anymore. I just yeah, I just don't care about the band's backstory. Yeah, you're not 16 anymore. Exactly. Like, oh, I relate to them so much. They're just people doing the jobs. I like the music, but I don't like the music. I don't need to know they can get a fucking first time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Mega long <laughs> Shut up. Whatever happened to him? No. The last I, I don't even know if he got. I presume he got. He's got jail time, but he just kind of. As um, always, once well, the Daily they, Mail got bored of him, he started yeah, exactly. reporting news about it. He was pleading insanity, wasn't he? So yeah, I don't, I don't know, know, but yeah, I, 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 I found it very. Or something. Oh yeah, I found it hard to believe that he would have got on, got off on an insanity, insanity plea. 
Oh, God. God. I don't Fucking know if that means you need to put the silver blade, the silver axe back on to kill it. Yeah, if, if you if ten minutes later you're still beating the shit out of it, you might need the silver bloody. Like the perfect time when why are the spinny things not working? Do they just, just they come up and down at intervals. Oh. Did you see the two girls dressed as the people from Frozen yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. So weird. Didn't, I, at first I thought that was some sort of elaborate, uh, another hen do, but it just appeared to be two women dressed as well. I don't know, I thought they were on their way to or from a fancy dress party. Indeed. Or they just were really like Disney. We should have gone to that party. In, well, if, if there weren't like a hundred uh, Arsenal fan cries echoing down every corridor of the underground, I would have shouted across the other side of the escalator, Do you want to build a snowman? But was, they wouldn't have been able to hear me. So. The sheep they'd have just gone, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> that would have bemused me. Or well, somebody would have just gone, that's racist. Or they would have gone, haha, you like Frozen, come to this party with us. And, and that's when they said, would have killed you. Fuck you guys, and then gone to a party. And then get killed in some kind of Disney <laughs> resurrection <laughs> spell. Yeah, they would have just made you put on the snowman costume. And you just have to reenact lines from the film. Right, maybe I should get this silver blade. Yeah. I also couldn't. I was amazed by how many Hindus we saw in London. All walking through Leicester Square. Though. Yeah, I don't know where they were going. I guess there's. I guess. Oh well, I guess there's lots of pla there's lots of stuff to do in Leicester Square. Obviously, there's restaurants, casinos, bars. Uh, Crazy people. So there's lots of stuff to see. That's why, oh yeah, that's where Dave's having his going. There. That's where they're doing their stag do, yeah. bachelor party, whatever the bloody hell is. I like how Zoe couldn't wrap her head around why I didn't want to go home. I was just like Robin wouldn't give me permission. She <laughs> <laughs> didn't even bother ask me why I didn't. Okay. Yeah. She knows you're yeah, yeah, but she knows you'll go anywhere where there's tips because you're that shallow. So <laughs> it's she not, was it's not a shallowness. That, that doesn't look like you. That, I'll go anywhere where there are tits. Makes it sound like I'd go to a war zone. Like if the army. If there were strippers, you'd go. Yeah, like if the if the army started saying, "Join the army, we will get you boobies." You, that's me. Like I'd be down the recruitment center so far. Yeah, sounds about right. It is incorrect. Unless I could be an officer. Well, you could, you've got a degree. Yeah. God, it's going wrong. She is useless. Is she even there anymore? That's why they got so much better when Fable 2 was co-op. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We got a damn sight easier. Yeah, we got two easier in Fable 3. Yeah, but that game is... I, I played the majority of that game. I played the first half with you and the second half on my own, and it wasn't that much harder on my own. That game was just too easy in general. Did they actually have a difficulty option? No. No. Never have. Hmm. I'm sure Molyneux would say it's not about the, the challenge. It's about the about experience. The story. Yeah. Which is another way of saying, shut up. <laughs> I'll tell you that they can save the Comic Con thing. Okay. I think now's really the time to start discussing our, our plans for going to Comic Con. I'm just saying, maybe we'll have a table there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so all eight of our fans can get signatures. Exactly. We could wear t shirts with our web addresses on the back, and our business cards. Wear our business cards. No, hand out business <laughs> cards. Wear, yeah, we'll, ha we'll, wear, we'll, ha we'll wear our business cards and hand out our t-shirts. We'll give you business cards to Natalie Dorman, yeah? Yes. Your personal number on it. Yeah. And, uh, and Selena Headley as well. Summer Glow I'm not as bothered about.
I'm gonna be running out of potions soon, I think. Probably who gives a fuck. Plenty of meat and shit. You got lots of meat. Meaty meat. Sex meat. <coughs> Next round. What am I fighting? Give them a big hand. Not small hand like Jeremy Beadle, but a big hand. Like somebody famous for having a big hand. Uh, Andre the Giant. He's yeah. got two big hands. Yeah, exactly. He was all big. What am I fighting? What am I fighting? So, are you fighting Whisper? No, you're fighting... No, bandits. Yeah. So Please tell me that oh, the no, fairies aren't going to pop up. It's even easier than bandits. Yeah, as long as there's no fairies in there. So the, the fairies probably will. Maybe 20 fairies. No, oh, yeah. God, when the fairies pop up, it's going to take longer to complete that than it will to do the rest of the game. Oops, get my uh, decent... Uh, yes, your shammer. Your shammy leather hammer. Yeah? Yep. Yeah. This shammy leather is a word I taught you because you had no idea what a shammy leather was. Indeed. Now I will never forget it. Unfortunately, you keep going on about them. Yeah, you use it to clean something. Cars. Cars. I remembered it to clean, I couldn't remember. The waxing what. cars. Waxing cars, there we go. That's why I should have got Graham for his birthday. A car or a chamois leather? Some chamois leather, he's got a car. There's a rose there. Kissed by a rose on you. Grab it, it's floating in the wall though. Yeah, I got it. I mean, there's not much use for getting. Well, you think they'd throw. Is there any that you've got maximum applause? You'd think they'd throw health items. Oh, that'd be cheating. <laughs> a pr well, still. Imagine you were watching your like WrestleMania and someone just threw the Undertaker a Red Bull. Uh, well, I don't think it would go down well, would it? Well, then I'd like, I'd like it if they threw them up. Well, this is a different. This isn't fake and wrestling, is it? What? Exactly. How dare you. Oh, how dare. I could have swore. I thought maybe it's, one of the, maybe it's in the second or third arenas they throw you weapons as well. Who knows? Maybe that's a completely different game I'm thinking about. There's lots of arenas in lots of games. And, uh, a lot of people's arenas are in there. A lot of ideas they were copied off of other games in there. Probably. Ian said he started playing Final Fantasy X again. I'm sorry to hear that. That's my <laughs> Oh no, 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 not Final Fantasy XIII, Final Fantasy X. That's the one on the PS2. Yeah, I know. I never liked it. Oh, did you not like well, that? Well, I'd never played it, but I saw the boss. And the plot seemed to be that the main character, who's a not a, not a basketball, because it's not basketball, no, it's but it's almost basketball. Something. Um, his dad has turned into a giant sloth, and he has to kill him. Yeah, well, yeah, giant, that that was weird. A giant slug. It was, but for a no, it, was a, it wasn't a slug. It was a sloth. Oh, yeah, it was a big monster. For a Final Fantasy game, it was a pretty simple plot. You know, dad was turned into a giant monster and he has to stop it. There was some time travelling ghost elements in there. But, oh, know, of course. Compared to uh, Final Fantasy uh, 11 or 12, I don't have to complete that, I still don't know what the plot that was. It's all about 7 and 9, the rest are all shit. 8 is good. No, it wasn't. You don't like 8, but you're in the majority. I'm in the minority. I still think 9 is the best of the series. It's the one I've completed the most times. And when we do our Let's Play of it... No. No. We're doing a Let's Play number 10. <laughs> no Final Fantasy games will ever be on this channel. Well, to be fair, they don't really work. They're very good. I don't imagine they're particularly great games to do Let's Plays of. Let's watch. You'd have to cut out loads of the grinding. Well, they would do a bike or something. What about your Let's Play of Persona 4? <laughs> I'm not doing a let's play, I'm just playing it, I'm not doing a play, let's play on it. You can get back and play that now that you can put your pound in flame, can't you? Yeah, but I need to do grinding. Yes, you do, but that's Yeah, the but grinding in that game is kind of boring because it's running down identical corridors fighting identical monsters. Yeah, I know, that's why I wasn't... Well, I, I want to read. I enjoy, three, I so. enjoy the plot, and I played number four and got in the same position, but I wanted to know what was happening in the plot, yeah, but yeah. I just couldn't be bothered to do the boring grinding. Can you not put a... Can you not put Game Genie on there? Probably. I'll have to find the codes and work it out and stuff. Yeah. 
That way you could at least you wouldn't have, you could you can enjoy the game. That's right, kids. We're con we are condoning cheating if you enjoy the game. Back in the day, we used to cheat on everything. Game Shark, everything. Wow. Well, Final Fantasy X is the only game I've ever, is the only Final Fantasy game I've ever used uh, cheats on. Yeah, I cheated on seven and eight and nine. Yeah. I think you you gave me the the cheats. You get you lent me your game genie for Final Fantasy Nine, and I didn't I was didn't end up using it. 